hello, good afternoon. Um, just thought I'd quickly pop on and tell you about a new product that I've got into stock um, and explain a bit about it. Um, it's called Transition. From, oh, it's back to front, of course, isn't it? Um, called Transition from Fusion Mineral Paint. Used to be called, oh, Colour Block, and it used to be called Concealer. Hello, Christine. Can't wait to meet you on the 3rd of September. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I'm just talking about this new product from Fusion called Transition. So, uh, it's just come into stock in the UK. You've been waiting for it for ages. What's really good about this is it's made from recycled um, Fusion paint, the pigments and the paint that, you know, the, the waste products from Fusion. And it's half the price of the normal paint. Hello, Shona. <laughs> it's half the price of the normal paint. So the purpose of this is to save you coats of paint when you're going from either really dark to really light. So say you're painting something in mahogany and you were painting it white, or the other way around, it was something white and you wanted to paint it black. Um, it, this is to save you coats of paint. So a lot of people, what they do is they will use a primer. Well, primers are pretty toxic if you want to use, you know, you're using fusion mineral paint because it's, you know, zero VOC and it's made with natural pigments and all that type of thing. And then you kind of undo that because you're going to use uh, a primer. So only use a primer when you have to. So this is not a primer. It will not block bleed through. Um, so if for bleed through, you still need to use the shellac based primer from Zinza. It's the only one that we recommend. So you still need to use that. So what this will do is just save your coats of paint. So if you were going from something really dark to really light, and you might end up having to use something like know three or four coats of paint then this is the product for you and that this is what will save you money and it's not toxic so some of the whites especially the bright whites like um, you know picket fence or casement don't have the same hiding qualities as colors such as ash because to keep their brightness and their whiteness they you know they just can't fill it up with sort of it's, they're not just not in a murky base it's in a clear base and so they need more coats of paint so transition um, it doesn't have the same excellent adhesion qualities that Fusion General Paint has. So the idea is that you know if you have if you're going to use um, Ultra Grip or use your first coat of paint, then instead of using two or three coats of more casement or picket fence or whatever, you could use a couple of coats of this. It has to be sandwiched in between two Fusion products. So that's either two coats of paint or um, you know ultra grip and and, and fu um, your fusion color so that's it so it's 10.99 so that is a big saving that's half the price because i know we get a bit kind of i mean i'm the same i've been scraping off my rollers when i was painting today because it's amazing how much paint they hold and you just want to save every drop so this is you know this is a great product for that it's sort of one of those things that you need to just keep in your stash when you put a coat of paint on anything this is going to take loads of colors loads of coats to uh, cover so would it bring would it work on black leather to bring it up to a lighter color yeah but i would still you if you're going to paint leather i would still use one coat of fusion and one coat of this then your other coat of your normal fusion um yes so yeah exactly that but if exactly that because with black leather if you're going to paint it a really light color that could take two or three coats so my tip to you as well roxanne is if you're painting leather check it hasn't been waxed so I would clean it just to be sure with white spirit, um, just to make sure that it hasn't got any wax. Well, even if it's not wax, it would have, you know, just the grease from our hands or silicone from polishes. So clean it with white spirit, rinse that off. You can even give it a little tiny scuff of sand and then, yeah, use your fusion. So first coat of normal, then maybe transition and then another coat of your colour. So if, it, if you think it's going to save um, some coats of paint, because to go from black to a really light colour is hard. So that's all I wanted to tell you is that Transition is in stock. Um, used to be uh, called Concealer. They actually stopped making it because there was so much confusion. People thought that it was a um, primer and uh then you know obviously people start to complain because they think it's a primer and then it doesn't block bleed through um it's literally as it sounds just a transition it's just to help you save some paint so that's it that was it really and it looks like if any of you are coming to the conference um it looks like we've got a spare ticket i'm not sure how much longer 
we can keep refunding and reselling tickets because I have actually sent off all the last final details to the conference centre. So I'm not sure, but if there's anybody out there that wants a ticket, contact me because it looks like we have one more ticket. Um, yeah, just when I think I'm done, then another one come on. Just when I think I'm done, <laughs> it's on and on and on. So anyway, I'm, you, you can't tell, but I'm actually sitting here leaning on eight crates of eight tesco crates full up with freebies <laughs> we have got some amazing stuff lined up for you and loads and loads of product i don't even know how we're going to squash it all in but it'll be fine it will be fine so anyway i just want to tell you that about transition it's in stock now if you want it um, or you've got any questions ask me and i will try my best to answer them they do have um they have got Quite a lot of instructions now on the sides of um, the fusion pots now and if you're noticing that all these labels are a bit crinkly yes they are they're temporary labels um there's so many um issues with stock um in production so poor old fusion um they can't get the usual um labels so they're having to use a different one and they're not as good but it's only temporary to be honest i don't care as long as what's inside it works um, and it doesn't stop me from getting my paint. I'm quite happy to have a dodgy label on it. So it was just to tell you that as well. Anyway, hello, Orla. And Orla orders paint from me, don't you, Orla? I recognise your name. So no questions. If there are, message me or comment below. Anyway, some of you. So I haven't been um, as active on here as I normally am because of all this admin and stuff for the conference. Um, but you'll probably get sick of me again in about a month's time when I've recovered. <laughs> anyway, so if I don't see you before, uh, you do, don't you? I recognise your name. Um, it's a lovely name, Orla. Um, if I don't see you before, I'll be seeing you for cocktails on the terrace, Friday the 3rd of September. Woo! 